hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today i will be showing you guys how i created this dope hairstyle um i as you can see it's totally different from the hairstyle that i had in my previous video and i honestly just got tired of the traditional pixie curl and the suit bangs like i really wanted something totally different and way outside of my comfort zone and i said well let's just go for it so um I went to the barbershop this morning and got my hair, my hair cut in the tutorial. Now forgive me because I wasn't able to continue filming after a while because um, I had to run out and do some, run some errands and I really didn't have the time to continue filming. So please forgive me for that but I do have another crochet video and I will list that down in the description bar below if you want to take a look at that. So in the beginning of the video you will definitely see me taking the hair and the hair that I used is from a brand called Sensational and it is the Canubia Bulk Snap and this is the Spring Curl in 24 inches in the color burgundy. Now I am surprised that this matched my hair like to a T like it is not, it's not off by a, by anything like it matches my hair 110 percent which is great so I ended up buying two packs of this hair and it's $5.99 at my local beauty supply store um I bought two packs thinking that I was going to use at least one and some but I literally used one bundle and a half of another one so I still have a half left plus this entire pack so I'll be able to recreate this hairstyle again which is great in the beginning of the tutorial you'll see me taking one of the um, strands and I ended up you know like splitting them but after a while as you can see like mostly on this side here it is really like a uh, full and fluffy but I did want to have a couple of strands in between with some definition so that's when you see like strands like this that still has that curl so I kept them as they were just kind of like fluffed out up up into like here and then left the ends uniform so that way it kept the curl pattern and it looked it gave it a really realistic look which is so funny because you know I posted a picture to Facebook earlier and my notifications started blowing up because I guess it's because it's something that I'm not used to doing so people were like so surprised and shocked to see that not only did I go red but I got this dope cut going on here it's totally different for me and I'm absolutely loving it so um, I know for a fact that I wanted to mimic um, a natural kinky kind of style and initially I was going to purchase the free press waterway just because that's what I'm used to I know that brand I know the curl pattern but it wasn't kinky enough for me and it didn't have that kind of like coil that I wanted so I ended up getting frustrated because I couldn't find a curl similar to what I wanted and I was gonna just give in and get the free dress water wave and literally as I'm walking to the register I see this and I was like this is exactly the kind of curl pattern that I want so I ended up picking up two packs of this and like I said before I didn't use the entire two packs I barely even used one entire pack of it which is great and um yeah I'm loving it a lot of people think that it's my hair like you know I just have like a really natural fro which is what I wanted so what I didn't show you guys in the video was me finishing, like I showed you guys the starting process and to be honest with you, I didn't do a lot of cutting, I kind of left it as is and just like snip, like I made sure to like pull down certain pieces so that way it mimicked to that of natural hair instead of it all being like scrunched and uniform, I, I don't like that look with any hairstyle that I have. So I um, pulled out a few of the pieces. I left some of the coils as is. I wanted it to mimic like a wash and go, like a really old wash and go or like a twist out or something of a natural hairstyle is what I was really going for. And I think I did a pretty decent job at achieving that look. So um, let me know what you guys think about it. I am loving it. I really think I want to go back and have them do something else to it and like do some dope designs in the back or something like I don't know I'm just ready to go all out and honestly if you guys see my last video with the pixie girls I was not feeling the color because I 
wanted I wanted this hair my hair to be blonde and she used the wrong color and I ended up with red hair so I mean it was a beautiful mistake like I said in my other video because everyone is loving it but um yeah this is definitely different for me and I am loving it um the hair itself is very very soft as you can see the texture of it is very realistic it looks really natural it's not shiny which I like it has kind of a a very very low luster to it which I like and what I do is if I need to add a little shine I use the argan oil um it's like a mist I'll insert a picture of it so you guys can see and I just use that a little bit I didn't use any on it now like I use it on my hair because I want it to match the luster of my natural hair so this is perfect I like the fact that it's low luster that in case you want you can add the shine to it which is good so um yeah let me know what you guys think about it and if you have any other questions or comments please make sure to list them down below and let's get into the tutorial bye guys Bound only by frozen memories